We are back! What's going on? Hello everyone! Welcome back to another exciting episode of Yokai Yokai Watch! No, I'm kidding, we're playing Animal Crossing New Horizons on Nintendo Switch. You might be confused with such awesome sprites over here. I get it. It's very confusing. We have the Yokai Watch characters in Animal Crossing. How does it even work? I don't even know. Thanks so much for watching. <clears throat> anyway, good to see you guys. <clears throat> so... I've noticed that a lot of you guys have been visiting my town recently. Thank you so much for doing that. Oh, we got a couple new character designs, uh, courtesy of Little Carrot. We have Darknyon. Someone kept on asking me the other day to incorporate Darknyon, and I absolutely saw every single one of those messages. Um, other than that, we got Hovernyon over here. This is looking good. Flyby is going to be pretty legit. Um, other than that, I did do a little, a little secret kind of Easter egg area, too, in case you guys like Yokai Watch 4. And I slapped some Yokai Watch 4 designs over here too. So, in case you didn't see, I didn't update the dream address yet, but we've got some of the Yokai Watch 4 uh, Yokai in here too. You've got like the Shadow Side, Light Side Whisper, you've got Junior, and then we also have Nekomata. And if you look in the very corner, you might see someone else. Oh, I don't know. Who, who is that? Who is that over there? Underneath the Cranky Kai? I don't know. You guys see him? I don't know. You guys are going to have to visit the dream address and find out. <laughs> so we got some other cool ones. Uh, what else did I add? I don't think I added anything else. We did get an, a, uh, a Lord Enma design. And Lord Enma looks really good. And I figured the only place that I could put Lord Enma was kind of over here. But I felt this area was a little, um, a little saturated with Insomni here. So I just kind of put him in the corner here. Where he's just kind of like watching over. But you really have to kind of find him. So anyway, Lord Enma's over there too. Looking really great. Um, other than that, I think we're ready. I think we're ready to do some work. Um, in case you guys did not see our previous episode, we filled out Nate's house. Like, Nate is here. He's ready to go. So, what I'm going to do now is we're going to start taking a look at all the different, um, the different things we can put inside of his house. And I'm going to need your help and support along the way so that we can find some pretty cool items to feature. So, this is Nate's house right over here. I can't do anything with his mailbox, but uh, yeah, this is his house, and we can go inside, but I can't decorate as him, so what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to decorate as myself. So I'll be, like, interacting with you guys, and I'm going to make a mock of his house in my house, and I'll show you guys the reference of what his house looks like in the game, but yeah, we're ready to go. Looks pretty cool. I thought that you can, like, close the shades or whatever, but whatever. It doesn't matter to me. All right. Good to see you guys. Thanks so much for coming. What's up, Stephanie? Hello. What's up, Malik? Romy's here. Katie's in the house, too. What's going on? Jay McLean's here as usual. Aaron Kelly, good to see you. Big Huss, hello. Great. Novi Prime, little carrot here, too. Excellent. Hi, Emily, Gemma. Great to see you guys. Thanks for hanging out. What are you guys doing today? It's a brand new week. We got some Super Mario 3D All-Stars happening very soon. I hope you guys will join me for that. I know it's going to be a, a little interesting. Because um, I know it's not necessarily the Animal Crossing content, but I really do hope you support those upcoming videos that we're going to be doing for Super Mario 3D All-Stars. Really hoping you enjoy it. Alright, so here we go. One of the things that I did also was I was able to get a, an invisible design. Or a transparent design. And I've been wanting this transparent design for a while. So that I can actually shape out some spots where weeds are growing. Right? So if you come over here with some invisible design, you can place them all the way around the areas so that you don't get any hybrids or any kind of like uh, breeding flowers or anything like that. So eventually, I'm really going to have to take a look at every single one of my tiles that are in my town and I'm just going to go full on invisible path because I don't want to have to worry about picking weeds. I don't have to worry about like fossils that show up. We have our fossils kind of buried right now, so it's really not that big of a deal. But I just don't want any weeds growing, so we're going to have to do this a little bit. I'm not going to spend the entire stream, like, making invisible paths or anything like that. But I do want to show you guys that it is a thing in case you want to make sure that you don't get any of the random flowers that kind of breed together. This is the best way of doing it. According to you guys, I don't know. I just played this game. There we go. So I want to do it over here just so we don't get any random hybrids and I have to keep on upkeeping it. Like, I don't want to have to do that. It's really, really high maintenance. And remember, we're done with flowers. 
<laughs> we are done with flowers. So, let's move on, shall we? You've been putting off your uh, transparent paths? I know, right? You have to. You just got to do it. You just got to suck it up and say, all right, today I'm going to do one acre of transparent paths. No one's going to talk to me. I'm just going to just going to do it, man. Don't talk to me. Just let me let me just do these transparent paths and let's call it a day. All right. So giving you guys the idea of what exactly I'm doing here. It looks like I'm just painting the ground with nothing, which is kind of what I want it to be. There we go. Such beauty, such grace. All right. Ladies and gents, that whole area is completely done. I don't have to worry about any kinds of um, any kinds of things that are just going to be growing over there. So yeah, we're good. One of the other spots that I noticed a lot of things growing was this area here. Like this, for example. Like I don't want a little money spot. Like forget that. Get out of here. <clears throat> oh man. Yeah, like I don't I don't necessarily want these things to be like all over the place. So I'm just gonna keep on going with the transparent path. And then I'm going to do this entire soccer field. And then once we're done with the soccer field, um, we'll start grabbing some ideas for the house interiors. I think that'll be really fun to do. Oh, I didn't show you guys S Sergeant Burley. Yeah, yeah, we got a Sergeant Burley design. So in the game, in Yokai Watch, there was a flagpole over here. And you would climb the flagpole every single day. And every day you'd go a little bit higher. And uh, Sergeant Burley was involved with that. And he'd say, come on, you chunky chicken nugget, climb higher. So that's why I put Sergeant Burley right over there. He's a pretty flagship yokai. He's like this uh, Tai Bo instructor kind of guy. You guys remember Tai Bo? <laughs> like some Billy Blanks? Dude, no one remembers Tai Bo, I'm telling you. All right, all right, here we go. Perfect. Perfect. <clears throat> Oh, Mario flagpole. Yeah, that we might have to do that. I don't know if any Mario items really fit in with this area, to be honest. It's really not very Mario-like. I'll probably, like, fill up my entire house, my personal house, with all the Mario items. Just so that you guys can see them. But no, I can't wait. But we got months for that, honestly. Like, when it comes out in March? No, we got months. And I think they're going to do it on March 10th. What do you guys think? March 10th? Makes sense? On Mario Day? Uh -huh. March 10th. 2021 Animal Crossing Mario items are going to be coming out. You guys heard it here first. So I can, can I do a corner like that? Yeah, I could throw a pattern on a corner. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, so this was... Yeah, perfect. So that's completely done on that side. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do that. There we go. And the soccer field is completely set with invisible patterns and I don't have to worry about any kind of like weeds or fossils growing in it anymore. It's not gonna be high maintenance. It's just gonna be done. So there we go. Okay, so that was a little, a little refresher course for some of you guys who may not know anything about the invisible patterns and what they do. So I wanted to show that off. So that's pretty fun for me. All right, well, let's get started. Let's get started on this and let's see what kind of items we can carefully pick out with their certain colors that we can actually get this going. So I'm very excited to see this. I was honestly like dragging my feet on it because like I have no idea how we're going to replicate this, but it's going to be pretty cool. So that being said, let's, uh, let's clear this place out, right? Let's clear it all out. Select multiple. See you later, crab. See you later, everything. Ah, okay. So I think the first thing that we have to do is we have to take a look at, we have to take a look at what it looks like in the actual game. So we're gonna come over here. I'm gonna show you guys what this is all about. All right, no thank you. All right, we're gonna go. So this is Yokai Watch. One of my favorite games on 3DS, for sure. And we're gonna do it. Thanks so much for hanging out today. <clears throat> All right, let's take a look. You can ring the bell too. Ring, 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 ring. Yeah, our town looks a lot like this for sure. 
I'm very happy with how it turned out. Whoa, that's a car coming right for me. Leodoni. All right, here we go. So do we have a flooring that looks exactly like this flooring? It looks like a vertical board flooring. Any of you guys experts on flooring and wallpaper? It looks like a yellow generic-y wallpaper. Yeah, what do you guys think? I may have thrown this out, to be honest. And then I'll actually bust out a another window for Nook Plaza so that we can see. <clears throat> pine Pinewood flooring? I don't know, let's see. Uh, this is going to be furniture, clothing, recipes, Nook Mile. Home style, here we go. Wood. Okay, so some of you guys are saying a couple things. You guys are saying standard flooring. I don't know if it's actually called standard. Wooden knot flooring looks like it. Wooden knot? Pine wood flooring? I don't know. Let me see. Pine. Pine board flooring. And then we look at the game. Yeah, I think that's it. I think we have a winner. Pine board flooring out of Nook's Cranny. Okay, that's great. Let's actually populate a list. I think that's going to be our best way of doing it. So here we go. Here's my list. And I'll make it a little bit longer. And then we'll just start going from there. All right, so here we go. Pine board flooring hyphenated. Pine board flooring. All right, cool. So now let's look at the wallpaper. What do you guys recommend for the wallpaper? Something like yellow? All right, let's take a look at it one more time. So this is going to be it right here. It looks like, if you take a look on the screen, it looks just like a, a plain yellow with a little bit of like brown trim on the bottom. Simple yellow. Yellow, simple cloth. I don't know. And you have to be specific with your name. You can't just say the yellow. <laughs> the yellow one because we have to look for it under that <clears throat> cute yellow wall has Wayne's coating Wayne's coating is not it yellow paint wall huh oh look at this yo this one's perfect yellow simple cloth dang all right that's it that's it some of you guys actually said that too yo this is this is really good what is soothing tea room wall? Okay, I don't think you're gonna beat this though. To be honest, look at this. You see this right here? You're not gonna beat that. It's yellow with the white uh, white flooring. Unless there is something with a brown trim, I don't know. What do we think, what do we think? <clears throat> Justina, hey, good to see you. Uh, yellow intricate wall? No, this thing is, it's too patterned. I need something plain. Yellow paint wall might be good too. It's like a stucco wall, but I think yellow simple cloth wall is probably the best. All right. I think this is it. I think we're going to call it yellow simple cloth wall. All right. So this is going to be yellow simple cloth wall. Got it. Okay. Yellow simple cloth wall. Let's, uh, let's kind of look around and see what other things that we need over here. I guess we could take a look at the TV, right? This one's going to be some sort of like... Um, I don't know. Is there a blue rug? Is there a blue rug? I guess I could look for a rug, right? Let's take a look for a rug. <clears throat> rug. Huh. Blue dotted rug. Aluminum rug. Black wooden deck rug. Blue shaggy rug. Hmm. Blue rug. Let's just type in blue and see what happens. Blue blocks? Hold on, what does it look like? Uh, interesting. What do you think? Oh, definitely not the fish rug. <laughs> definitely not. <laughs> I do not like the fish rug. Um, blue rug. Blue Persian rug? I think it's, I think blue shaggy rug? Oh, it's like nine. Oh, it's five by five? It's too big. Are all rugs that big? 
I said two by two. I'm, I think I might go with this. A two by two. Hmm. Are there rectangle? Simple medium blue mat? Simple medium blue mat. Three by three. <gasps> that might be it. Look at this. And this one's a two by two. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that's by Sahara though. Oh, that's hard to find. Yeah, Sahara's rugs are very hard to find. Okay, well, we'll throw out a... Um, yeah, yeah, we'll throw out a, a call to one of you guys in the comments. Simple, it's a three by three. So let's kind of, let's gauge this. If that's gonna be a three by three, then we do need some sort of like table where we throw magazines and like a remote control. And I don't think there's anything like a remote control in the game. I don't think so. But magazines we could do, right? Magazines. Okay, so I think I'm sold on this. Simple, simple medium blue mat. Okay, simple medium blue mat. That's good. Uh, talk to me about magazines. I might need some. Oh, sorry, it's not in home style. But we could look at furniture. Magazine. All right, eh, it could be anything. All right, so any of the magazines should be fine. I'll type that over here. Magazine. What do you think? There's a cordless, oh, there is a cordless phone. Ah, I like the idea. Talk to me about cordless phone. Let's see. Yeah, cordless phone could work if we have like the black one. Black cordless phone from Nook's Cranny. All right, that can fill in the spot pretty well. Okay, I like it. And then what kind of, uh, Katie was recommending the rattan low table. Let's look at low tables. Uh, rattan low table, yeah, 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 absolutely. In some different colorations. Let's look at our different colors here. So it looks like I may need, I don't think there's a console. Do you guys know? Is there like a console for this? Like how, where am I gonna put the TV on? Interesting, interesting. Okay, so I do like this brown rattan low table. It looks really good. So let's just see our wish list here. Brown is fine. Rattan low table, brown is exactly what we're gonna need. And these have to be specific, specific. Okay, that's our list so far. All right, so I think we got a lot of things going over here. We need a couch. Is there a yellow sectional? Let's talk about the couch. Could you put a TV on a dresser? I don't know. I don't know. You can make a wooden chest. All right, so there's two things that are kind of in the in the works right now. We need a couch and we need this, this um, item over here. I don't know what this is. Use a backwards brown desk for the TV to sit on. What is a brown desk? Let me see. Uh, you're talking about this one? A lecture hall desk? Um, I mean, that could be it. That's an idea. Are we talking about this dark wood den desk? Oh, the den desk. Oh, whoa, the back of the den desk. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, brown. Brown wood. Yeah, if you spin it around, I'm sure it looks pretty ornate on the back. Dang, that's a cool idea. All right, let's go. We're gonna go den desk brown. I hope it's the same color brown as the low table. We may have to mess around. All right, so let's see, look at this. Let's do sofa. Okay, so sofa. Obviously we're not gonna do box corner sofa. We could do cardboard sofa. Does that sound like something we could do? I don't know. It looks like, I don't know. It looks kind of like a love seat. The double sofa in white. Oh my gosh, that might be it. Yeah, all you guys are really high on double sofa. Okay, okay, I like it. Double sofa in white. Man, all right, all right. We're doing this, so a cute sofa is not good enough? It's too cute, there's, there's a pillow on it. I mean, okay, fine. <laughs> Forget the cute stuff. All right, let's go. So double sofa, I'll add it to the list. Here we go, double sofa. Oops, <laughs> double sofa in white. 
All right, so now, and then we just need the TV, right? I could have sworn it's like a TV. LCD TV in black. I think I may have this. Yeah, there we go. That's the LCD 50 inch TV in black. That could fit right on top of the desk. Oh, this is so cool. We're filling this up. LCD TV 50 inch black. Done. Okay, I think we did really well. So now it's just an issue of taking a look at the other things that we need on our shopping list. All right. So um, that's this little area here, which is great. I like it. We need also a little computer area. Ooh, okay, so talk to me about this. It's a little, it looks like a one by, maybe like one and a half by desk with a little tiny blue chair and like a computer screen. Isn't there something like that? What, what do you suggest for like this little corner? Oh, ah, that's me, that's me. Oh man, that's a bummer. Yo, this is an old 3DS. Okay, anyway, while this thing boots back up, uh, let's talk about that. Yo, if I look at this thing the wrong way, it'll completely turn off. This thing's ancient. It's like ancient Enmo over here. Anyway, talk to me about that desk. All right, you said school desk? Let's see, desk. School desk. This thing? You think so? What color was it? You know, I think school desk can work. It's like a little one by, yeah, 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 school. Can you put something on it though? Huh. Let's see. The desk can be a white TV tray. I don't know about that. I guess I could put the desktop computer over there. Web browsing, programming, art program. Look at this. Silver desktop. Yeah, the desktop should be able to fit that. All right, let's do it. We're going to do silver desktop. We're going to call it silver desktop computer. I think I may have one. I don't know. Uh, that's 100,000 bells at Nook's Cranny. That's a lot of money. All right, so we're going to call school desk. I have to take another look at it. What color the school desk? I think I'm going to go silver. All right. <sighs> that day in the forest. Oh, you remember that, huh? It was all that day in the forest. I can't imagine trying to capture any 3DS game. I'll be like walking on pins and needles playing with this thing. All right. So I'm going to run over there really quick. Uh, do you guys have any other ideas of what coloration that desk should be? Did that work? Hold on. We're back, right? Oh, yeah, we're back. Here we go. <laughs> Uptown Triangle Way. Here we go. Tell me you guys all went to Five Below and purchased Yokai Watch for five dollars. It's the best thing. It's the best five dollars you'll ever spend. I'm gonna give them away <laughs> as uh, instead of candy for uh, for this Halloween. I'm gonna give away copies of Yokai Watch. <laughs> all right. So it's a white desk, and I need like a little baby blue chair. It's a white school desk. All right, so this is a white and red school desk. Let's go. That looks good. All right, beautiful, beautiful. All right, and now we need like a little chair. Talk to me about this little blue chair. Okay, what kind of chair are we thinking here? Folding chair, modern office chair. Oh, it could be a school chair, uh, but they don't have a blue one. Wedding chair, no thank you. Uh, I don't think, uh, wooden chair. What was wooden chair? Let me see, wooden chair blue. It almost looks like, it doesn't look wooden though. Is there a folding, uh, maybe a folding chair. Yeah, you know, I think I might go with this blue folding chair. 
I think I might folding chair in blue is a little bit more it's a little bit more plasticky like I can see that I don't think that any other any other ones scream other than like if we did a blue um office chair I mean that would kind of be cool but I don't know what do you guys think wooden Okay, wooden or folding? You guys do it. All right, here you go. Ask your community. The vote, the poll is up. Wooden or folding? Which looks best? It's a tough one. It's a tough one. Folding gets the plat the plasticity right, but wooden gets like the the shape right dang it's a close one you guys are really close i think folding might win this one we're at it's a 50 50 split dang okay careful yokai watch game you are ancient all right it's right in front of me it's not going anywhere Oh, dang it. It is going somewhere. <laughs> Every time. Yo, what's the deal? Yo, I look at it the wrong way and it turns off. All right. So I think Wooden wins. We're going to go with Wooden. I'll end the end the poll right now. It's honestly, it's a 50-50 split with 232 of you guys right now. So that's it. It's a flip of a coin. So we're going to go Wooden. All right. So a blue wooden chair. It's crafting. So we might need that. Let's add it. Uh, wooden chair blue. Wooden chair blue. Okay, cool. And then we saw a dining table with four chairs. I don't know how or how we're going to incorporate that. What kind of table would you guys recommend? Antique table? Ooh, whoa, with the light brown antique table. That looks really good. Are you seeing this? Are you seeing this table? It's a four, it's a two by two. That day in the forest. Antique table in natural looks really good, but don't we need some chairs to go with it? That day in the forest. Yeah, I think antique table wins that one for sure. Do they have matching tables for antique? Or sorry, matching chairs. You do. Oh, and you have them in natural. I think it only makes sense. Yeah, I think that's fine. We are going shopping today. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I think we're good. We're going shopping today. Let's go. All right. So I guess the question is, how in the world are we getting these items? I think it's really all up to you guys to take a look in your catalogs and see what you can order. If you guys have any of the colorations or anything like that, we will be specifically looking for those colors. And then I'll, I'll bust out a dodo code and like, go get them from you I don't mind but this is gonna be like we can't I don't really feel like we can ad-lib a lot of this because it's very specific so let's uh, let's see how as accurate we can get it let's see how accurate we can get it all right so I think this area seems fine we got the nice flooring we got the nice wallpaper uh, the kitchen the kitchen's gonna be a little different, right? So the kitchen's gonna be upstairs. Um, inside, yeah, yeah, inside the main room, it's going to be, ooh, that's hard, right? That's really hard to, to do. Wow, right? Because of like, if you see an Animal Crossing house, it's not as like, yeah, it's not as big as this. Oh, this is weird. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh 
how do we even... I don't know. I think I just need the stuff. Uh, you know, I think this is a good start. Yeah, I think this is a good start. Let's just try to get these items. And then we'll just place them accordingly. Alright, I'm gonna slowly push this down. Okay, there we go. Good, good. Just stay. <laughs> stay. Alright. So, um, yeah, let's, uh, let's see what's going on in the world of Animal Crossing. We should be all set. Let's switch scenes over here. Let's get ready to go, right? Why the heck not? Alright, so... <sighs> Ideally, I'd like to have a little rug over here. Like an entrance rug and some like little shoes. Like some shoes to the left and to the right to make it look like you're taking off your shoes over here. Um, so I kind of want to do that, like a pair of shoes left and right. Um, walking in a small, maybe like a one by two rug if it exists. I don't think it does. So then we'd need the computer desk over here. We need the computer desk and then the computer chair, which is just two squares, right? It's just two squares in the corner. I'm going to do the antique table and chairs over here. And then I guess the sofa is just going to be up in the middle. I don't know. I mean, maybe we'll have to throw the, um, maybe we'll have to throw like the, the dining room table up here, but then the kitchen's going to be super small, right? Yeah, I don't know, but I got to get rid of all this stuff. Oh man, my Raymond, po my, my Raymond photos. What the heck? All right, no worries. Goodbye. Yeah, because then, like, we could do the kitchen here. The kitchen should be fine. I should be able to do this fine. There's, like, the, the diner top. Anyway, let's just do one thing at a time. Whew. All right, so who's got the stuff, right? Let's take a look at this. Is it that? Yeah, that is that. Here we go. So let me see. All right, let me see if I can move this a little down. These are the items that we're looking for. Pine board flooring. There we go. Look at that. Incorporating it into the stream layout. That's what we need. Ladies and gents, this is what we're looking for. I'll uh, start taking a look at mutuals. If any of my mutuals that are on my friends list wants to mail me something, let me know. We'll check it off the list and we'll get it going. We'll have a fun time with it today. All right, what do we have? What do we have? I gotta go all the way over here to get my mailbox though. So this, I'm gonna have to take my mailbox back from the post office, sorry. Gimme, oh, where's my post office thing? I think it's over this way. Yo, green Lamborghini, gimme that. You got, okay, H Fenton, you got double sofa in white, beautiful. That's one thing that we need. I kinda wanna get this, um, this wallpaper and flooring though. That's like the first thing that like really just pops. So let's see. Yellow simple. Right? All right, place item. Oh my gosh, I got a lot of junk in my pocket. Ooh. Yeah, I got a lot of junk. All right, here you go. You can live free, little buddy. Catch you later, dude. See ya. All right, what do we got? Okay, I don't know what all these things are, but let's take a look. <clears throat> uh, an oval entrance mat. Okay, let's take a look. This one is a shiny new fan. I don't know what a fan. What's up? Luna? Who the heck is Luna? An oval entrance mat. We got McGonagall. A den desk. Okay, things are coming. Things are coming. Optical sky. Rattan low table. Nice. And Romy with the shiny new magazine. Nice. All right, so let's let's throw them over here and let's see what's up. <clears throat> All right. So we got stuff, and we got things. Let's see how they're gonna fit. Oval entrance mat could be something we can use. I'm not sure what the fan is all about. This is the oval entrance mat. Here's a den desk. 
Rattan low table and a magazine. Okay. Okay, let's uh, let's take a look around and see what we can do. So the first things first is going to be this den desk. We're gonna place this. Oh yeah, that looks good. Whoa, the back part of the den desk looks actually good. Yeah, good job. Oh, look at me like a like a peasant pushing things around. What a concept. Not nah, forget that. Put the den desk over here. Let's take a look at pockets. I forgot that this was a thing, an oval and oh my gosh, an oval entrance mat. That's perfect. Thank you so much. That looks exactly like it is in the game. Oval entrance mat is the exact same one. Thank you, both of you. Uh, let's take a look at a fan. What is a fan for? Uh, maybe upstairs or something? Whatever, I'll pocket it. We'll put it in storage. Clumps of weeds? Yeah, sure. <laughs> no. What was that thing we saw today? <laughs> Where's the rattan low table? Oh yeah, ooh, look at this thing. Okay, so maybe this is, can I get a different color of that den desk? Rattan low table, or does it honestly matter? I don't know. I don't know. Let me see with that again, really quick. The den desk. And then you guys can see it too. Where are we? Here we go. What? Oh yeah, here. Is it den dusk? Oh yeah, we gotta get that other color. That brown wood or natural. What did we say on our list? Den dusk brown. Uh, I think natural would look good with that rattan. Den dusk natural wood. Let's try that. All right, so that's pretty specific. Can you guys answer me in the comments? Can I grab this den desk and go customize it? All right, so what do we have? Magazine's done. Rattan low table brown is done. It is not customizable. Oh no. Okay, so this den desk is not what we need yet. Okay. Here we go, switch scenes. Let's take a look. Hmm, I think I have a TV in my storage. It's called LCD TV. I think I may have one. I remember going big on like ordering those a long time ago. I may not though. I have it, oh yeah, big guy. Let's go LCD TV, got it. Oh, beautiful. I don't have sofa though. Okay, so we may have to hold off on the den desk, but until we get a replacement, it's gonna stay. Let's do this. Uh, it's gonna be pockets. Here's this. Oh, it's a 20 inch? Oh no, it's a baby. No, forget the 20 inch, dude. I need a 50. I may end up ordering it. How about this? All right, let's 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 uh, let's, let's see my, um, I think I have it. Okay, okay, let's take a look. Um, miscellaneous, housewares, everything. I'm gonna do LCD TV in 50 inch black. Oh no, I don't think I have it. I just have white. Oh, lame. Okay, so I don't have it. So I wish I did. So I still need that. Let's do desktop computer. I think I may have it in silver. Desktop computer. I have it in black. Right? That's the only thing I have it in. Oh, man. I mean, I could just use the one that I have in my other room. Like, what am I What am I using it for? It's fine. Uh, it doesn't have to be. It, it doesn't have to be silver. It's Because, like, you can't customize those things, and having the silver one is so specific. No, I'm good. Just give me this thing. Yoink! Oh, what is this? Is this my den desk? Hold on. It's, it's too dark. No, that's the dark den desk. Ooh. Uh, at least it's a it's a shade more correct. Or unless it's the exact same thing, man. All right, this is rough. Dude, interior design is so specific. I mean, it's a better color, but like, it's not. 
That's not right. Okay, there's the desktop computer. And the den desks are there. This is not the right color. It needs to be that natural wood color to match this table. Or maybe the rattan table needs to be a little bit darker. I don't know, either or. Oh, we got a silver computer in the mail? All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look in the mail. You got mail. AOL screen name. All right, we got some, whoa. We got some stuff. All right, Optical Sky, which is the Den Desk Brown. All right, let's see. This is also the shiny new desktop computer. Thank you for ordering those. Holly with the double sofa. Nice. Carrot with the winky face. Don't know what that means. Optical Sky with the blue wooden chair. Hey, look at this. This is easy. Holly with the pine board flooring. Excellent. Optical Sky with the antique natural chair. Whoa. Oh, you're sending me all these chairs. Oh, this is great. This is way easier now. Going shopping. All right, you're probably like resetting to send the rest of the chairs. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> All right, this is good. This is good. Let's see what we have here. Desktop computer. I don't know who sent what, but thank each and every one of you guys. Pine board flooring. Yeah, you got to go vertical boards too. All right. Let's go. Throwback to the antique chairs that I used to gift Audie. <laughs> you remember that? <laughs> I don't believe you remember that. It was a good time. All right, for science. Here you go, Audie. Have some antique chairs. All right, let's do this. Uh, this is a den desk. What color is this? Ooh, that's the one. That's the one. All right, see ya. Here we go. That's the one. Absolutely. All right, tell me someone sent me a TV. Desktop computer. In white, nice, okay? You go away, you stay here. All right, you're gonna go right here, right? Yeah, this is fine. Okay, until we get the small little school desk there. Beautiful, pockets. Double sofa, woo, double sofa, all right. See, I don't know where I'm gonna put this thing. Like, we can do that, but it's kind of like, kind of clashing, to be honest. It's a little clashy. I mean, I could do this, and I could do this sofa in the middle. Yeah, you know what? I think that's fine. I think that's okay. Look at this thing. That's so perfect. All right, all right, all right. Let's take a look. Pine board flooring, place on floor, vertical. Yeah, oh, yeah. There we go. Boxing ring mat. Nope. Pine board flooring, thank you. A uh, wooden chair. Oh, this was the baby chair. Oh, yeah, yeah. You guys uh, were very, very hot on this. So let's go. Okay. Oh, get out of here. What is this? How do I get on top? Mm, plus. There we go. Get this thing out of here. Get that wreath out of here. Get that shirt out of here. What do you have? Some sort of lucky items that I just left on the walls because I thought that feng shui existed? Get out of here. All right, next. We have the antique chair one. Whoa, okay. Ooh, wow, that's a fat chair. That's a fat room over here. And look at these. Because like if, if the chair is gonna be um, it's a, a two by two, I guess what I could do is I could just put it in the corner, right? If I could put it in the corner and then the two by two is over here, right? And then the other two chairs are going to be like right in here. So if I put it against the, the corner, I think it should be fine. And then don't we need another sofa? Hold on, what are we, what are we doing here? All right, so pine board flooring is done. I need that wallpaper though, I may have it. Den desk, natural wood, done. Double sofa, done, thank you. Uh, I need a school desk. We'll take a look and see if I have it in catalog. Desktop computer, done. Wooden chair, done. Antique table. Uh, two more of these chairs. And then I think we're we're kind of done with it. And then I need some shoes. Because I never go to, t like, Kicks. I, I went to Kicks once when he first came out. I'm like, oh, this is kind of cool. But, like, now he just sits in the plaza, like, out of business. Because no one buys his junk. So, let me take a look. 
Uh, I'm not done building for now. What kind of shoes? I don't know. Let's uh, let's consult the game. What kind of shoes do we want? <laughs> like, we're going so far as to match the exact shoes. Okay, you can give me a pair of red. Oh, those are, yeah, those are female uh, red slip-ons and a, pl a pair of black shoes. I, You guys, oh, you don't even see this. I'm sorry. Here. <laughs> Here. So it looks like red, no, yellow slip-ons. Like, they look like a ballerina type shoe. So you guys can absolutely hook me up with that. And then like a pair of black, it looks like, I don't know, like a black lace-up men's shoe. I don't know. That's like cherry on top. I don't know if we're gonna do anything like that, but uh, yeah. I don't know if anything exists, to be honest, so. All right, let's take a look. Yellow ballet shoes might be it, Stephanie. Yeah, they do make ballerina shoes? All right, I'll take that. Or yellow flats, whatever. Whatever you guys have, send me some shoes. And if they work, we'll keep them. If they don't, they'll go in storage. All right, here we go. I think these are the next, oh, yo, the ant chair. Mm. Let's go, more ant chairs, thank you. And then Lan, a blue mat. Oh, was that the blue mat that we're looking for? Ooh, I forgot about the blue mat. Did I put it on there? Simple, medium, blue mat? Well, thanks, Lan. All right, I need that wallpaper though. Looking, It's sticking out like a sore thumb over here. Pine board flooring. Bo oh, I gotta open it first. All right, here we go. Where is it? What is this? Boxing ring mat put in storage. Where did that rug go? Oh, did I not take it? Dang it. The boots from fishing, Joel? Ah, <laughs> no. That's trash. No, man, we're not gonna put trash in the house. No, we need actual boots. All right, oh, oh, we got some ballet slippers. Let's take a look, let's take a look. They might be the ones. They might be the ones, but we do have our chairs now. So let's take a look. I gotta open up. All right, here we go, ballet slippers and then medium blue mat. Uh oh, things are looking good. Let's see, let's see. Will this be the one? Uh, pockets. And then this is gonna be the simple blue mat. Whoa, whoa, uh, it can work. It, it can and does. It can and does work. I'm happy with that. Very happy with that. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That looks great. Ballet slippers. Yo, we got the yellow slippers. Okay, here we go. We're gonna put those right over there because that's where you put your, uh, all right, I can put them on the wall. No, no, putting them on the floor is fine. You can put shoes on the wall. This is good. All right, so that works. The little the little flats. And then we do have the extra chairs. Okay, so now we're just, yeah, it's coming along. It looks a little tough to fit this over here because the walkway is literally only two squares right over here. So that's a little rough for me. Unless I do this and then you can't really sit down. Oh, hold on. I guess you could do this. I don't know. I'll have to mess around with this. Because you need a nice little walkway in between. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, this is good so far. Okay, let's take a look. So we have the medium blue simple mat done. How do I look at uh, wallpaper? It's called simple, simple H. I don't, you know what? I honestly never buy wallpaper from the kids. So I don't have it. Simple cloth wall. And it's not under Y for yellow. It's it's just called a simple cloth wall. Absolutely not. No way. All right, so I don't own that. 
<laughs> one of the things that I, you know, I tried disciplining myself way back in the day in like March when this game first came out. Like going into the shop and like buying out all the wallpapers, but then I would lose track of which ones and I ended up buying doubles and it's just like, it's silly. So no. Uh, let me do antique table. Unless that's crafting. Antique. Antique chair. Antique clock console table. Uh, antique table I only have in black. Yeah, this is not going to work. I do not have the natural color antique table. So it's unfortunate. It's unfortunate. Uh, antique chairs are done. So I don't, have, uh, I don't have to put that anymore. Done, done. School desk. Let's take a look at school desk. All right, Jay McLean, you mailed the phone. Thank you so much. QRS for school desk. School desk. Oh, blue one. I only have the blue one. What is that bag on the side? What? Is that like a trash bag? Is that a bag? Is that a sandwich in there? Oh, what? <laughs> Yo, a little baguette. All right. No, I don't have the white school desk. Okay, so that's really it. Only four things were missing. And then this room is pretty much done, with aside from the shoes. Aside from the pair of shoes, which I may scoot over a little bit. Black wingtip shoes, maybe. Let's see what people send. Ooh, here we go, thank you, thank you. So this is the white and red. Okay, this is the light burr, yeah. Carrot sends something mysterious, okay. And this is a cordless phone, okay, look at good. You guys are doing really well with, like, cataloging a whole bunch of random stuff. Good job. I need to visit one of those catalog islands, right? The heck? What in the actual world? I have to do that. Like, have a catalog party. I need all the colors of this thing right now so I can reorder it. Dang. Catalog island. All right, let's do this. Keep on pressing up. All right, next is going to be the school desk. Red and white, beautiful, with the baguette. Done. Okay, that looks good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks fine. It's weird with the blue chair, but sure. Doing as best as we can. All right, rattan low table. Uh, I think I'm good. I think I'm good, but thank you. And steel-toed boots. Whoa, that's it. That's it. That's the one. Steel toed boots. I'm gonna do this like one half over. Yeah, there we go. One half over. There we go. There we go. Take your shoes off as soon as you come in. Perfect. And then last but not least, the cordless phone. Yeah, right here. Let me rotate it a little bit. It looks like the remote control. Done. <laughs> okay. So we're really only missing three things right now. That is the black 50 inch TV. Ooh, which I didn't. I accidentally crossed that off. All right, so yeah, this is uh, LCD TV, 50 inch black. LCD TV, 50 inch black. All right, how are we doing guys? Do, do you guys have those items? If we don't, then I'm gonna go open up a dodo code and we're gonna go visit some people because things are looking really good. And then we need that antique table natural to match these really quick. And then I think we're done. Like this looks really, it looks really sharp. I think that once we get rid of the nonsense fireworks wallpaper, it's gonna look like night and day. It's gonna look so amazing. All right, let's go. Let's go. If you want to send me a dodo code, send me a dodo code if you have any of those items, I'll grab it. All right. Oh, I threw Golden Yon over here too. Cause in Yokai Watch 4, he hangs out by the community center. And you, gotta gr you have to grind his battle in order to get him. All right, you know who you are. Durr. 
All right, talk to me in the chat. Give me a dodo code and you have to tell me what you have with your dodo code. All right, here we go. Roger that. Come on out, my friend, calling Jibanya on Yokai Metal, do your thing. Yeah, how'd you know? You remember this game? No one knows what Yokai Watch is. Come on, man. Don't be silly. Okay, should be good. Let's fly. Let's go to BB Beans. <laughs> BB Beans. Talk to me about BB Beans. All right. Renee Star has the antique table. Thank you. Uh, Grisama says that you got a 50 inch TV. Thank you. Oh, man. We got some gate crashers here. That's not good. People, if you have, if there's a dodo code in the chat, that's not an open invitation for you. Just, you're wasting all of our time. And I really only have about 45 minutes left of this live stream. I got to do something else later. So, again with the gate crashers. It's unfortunate. I'll try like two more times. If it works, it does. Um... Okay, look, fine. This is good. He says, I appreciate your patience. A patience with gate crashers? No, man, it's unacceptable behavior in the Animal Crossing community. Very frowned upon. Don't care who you are. We got work to do, man. We don't have to waste time. You're wasting 1,200 people's time by gate crashing. Good job. Anyway, no more unnecessary attention to that. You guys know the drill. You guys aren't new. Let's go. This is your captain. We're almost at BB Beans. Oh, look at those blue roses. Cool. Hey, oh, you got some mushroom. Oh, I cannot wait till mushroom season. Yeah, that's gonna be a fun video to make. Pardon our progress. Oh, look at that. That's cute. That's cool. All right, let's see. Yellow simple cloth wall antique table LCD TV 50. We had a lot of things on our shopping list. And thank you to everyone that has communicated with that. All right, we're gonna ignore that guy. Simple cloth wall, do not. Oh, so now he's gonna pick up the stuff? Okay, that's cool. Well, that's unfortunate. See, that's even more disrespectful. So he actually picked up the stuff. It's great. So this, this guy not only took a dodo code he wasn't invited to, he went over to it, waited over here, and then took the stuff that was meant to be for me. Great. Cool. Wow. And some people think I'm low-key being rude to a fan. Can you believe that? Me being low-key rude to a fan. Okay, sure. I can't believe someone said that the other day. That actually bothered me a lot more than it should have. It's just silly. You don't. These are the things you don't do. And I don't have the items either. So, a big waste of time there. Thank you. Thanks. Stupid. So bad. I don't have the items. So. Yep. 
Everything is gone. We just wasted the last 10 minutes doing that, so... Cool. Good job. Here's hoping some mutuals can bail me out instead of doing that. So that's the... Uh, like, I love coming over to a dodo, but... Look, you got random people that are just gonna mess around, so... Whatever. Okay, yellow simple cloth wall. Perfect. Thank you so much. Uh, and then we got a smiley face. Thank you. We got Ren with the antique table. And another yellow wall. Thank you so much. So I think we got all the things. The only thing we don't have is the black 15 inch TV. So that's kind of our missing piece. That's the missing piece of the puzzle. And I had it. I had it in my pockets, but um, yeah. All right, let's put this wall. There we go. Oh my gosh, it's like night and day. Yes. Beautiful. L oh, we do have the TV. I'm sorry. We do have it. Never mind. Never mind. Antique table. And another simple cloth wall. This is perfect. This is absolutely perfect. Thank you guys. I think we finished it. I think the room is finished. And then I'll give you guys a side-by-side -side comparison so that you guys can be the judge on how it looks. Uh, Trish. What's up, Trish? Hey, welcome. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for coming. All right. What is it? Is this the black TV? It looks like a red TV. It's a TV. I don't think it's the TV. What the heck color is that? I don't know. It's a 50 inch TV though, so like, it can be a placeholder. Until we get the correct one. Yeah! Oh, it looks good! What color TV is that? I think that's silver? <laughs> I don't know what the heck color TV that is. It looks kind of cool. The house looks good. I think, I think, honestly, I think we're good. I mean, we could ad lib a couple things on the wall. I think that the walls are missing something. Like maybe like a portrait of flowers or something. Oh yeah, a coffee cup on the dining table. I have a coffee cup. I do, I do, I do have a coffee cup. That is 100% correct. I do have a coffee cup. I don't know where... It's by type, right? Here we go. What color is the coffee cup? <laughs> do, 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 do. Please do not. Alright, the color coffee... Uh, it's white? Yeah! You know what? This is fine. You're mine! A coffee cup. Perfect. Oh my... Dude, you should see this coffee cup. And what a perfect replica it is. I'll show it to you right now. Look at this coffee cup. You see it right here. It is the perfect replica of the coffee cup that's directly inside the game. I cannot be more happy with the coffee cup. Done. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, let's do a little side by side here. All right, so this is what we're looking at. The TV is like, I don't know. If any of you guys have the black one, I'll take the black one. I somehow got like a silver one, but... I'm not gonna be complaining. It, it fits it right now, it's a placeholder. And I think it looks good. Okay, so we have the shoes. The shoes right up front, which look good. We got the sofa, I think it's perfectly spaced. I mean, not necessarily, like I can honestly push it over here. But I think that's a little much. Yeah, I guess for symmetry purposes, putting this in the middle would make sense. But I just really don't like this squeeze here. I don't like this squeeze at all. But, like, I can see that. I mean, maybe we mitigate that squeeze by... No, we can't. I was going to say, if we do this entire spot here, if we bring this and then we rotate it so it's against that top wall, it wouldn't work because that's... Um, one, two, three, four. That's four by two. And that, no, that just wouldn't work. So, I think this looks fine. But the walls are very bare. I think the walls are very bare. So, yeah, I think the symmetry looks perfect. Yeah, you know, I think we're fine. Yeah, this is good, this is good. We need something. We need absolutely something for the walls, right? Like, that's the thing. Let me sh let me show you guys over here. All right, so taking a look at it, 
We need something for the walls. Oh, there was, you know what? I think there is such thing as an air conditioner. Oh, there's a plant. Oh, I didn't realize there's a hidden plant there. I think I, uh -huh. you see on the very bottom corner? Where am I gonna put that plant? Where am I putting that plant? And then I think there's an air conditioner unit. Correct me if I'm wrong, there is one. I remember seeing one somewhere in like a town tour. We've done it. Um, yeah, so we need an air conditioner. An air conditioner and something else. All right, all right. So there is there is a there is a wall AC unit. Yes, there is. I think I may have it. What is it called, ladies and gents? Do you guys know what it's actually called? And don't you dare say air conditioner. Dang it! All right, if you guys have one, I'll take it. I'm not trying to skip out on bells. I just don't want to skip to the next day. I think it's a waste of time. Where you guys can just do two clicks and it'll just show up in my mailbox. Okay. Uh, if you have the air conditioner, I'll take it. If you don't, I'll order it. Talk to me about uh, some mutuals if you guys have it. Take a look over here. Um, other than that, like, what else are we doing? What else goes on the wall? A boomerang? Portraits? A cork board? Not really. A clock of sorts. A detailed painting would be pretty cool. Flowery painting would be cool. Whoa, what the? Oh yeah, you're tall? Is that what that is? Oh, interesting. Hmm, I don't remember her growing in size. I thought she was just facing the other way, but sure. Hanging scroll! Oh my gosh, a hanging scroll, dude. Oh, this looks good too! Is there a yellow? Hold on, hold on, I need to look this up. Because that would be amazing. Truly, truly, uh, Carly, hi, welcome. What is this thing called? Imperial decorative shelves, oh my gosh. I think black would be slick. Imperial decorative shelves, oh, black would be amazing with the black and yellow. Yeah, I'm adding it to the list. Okay, it's on the list. It's gonna be Imperial. Decorative shelves black. Okay, uh, yes, there's that. I think that would make a great thing. Um, we still need that air conditioner unit. Okay, air conditioner. Hmm, I don't know. Leo sculpture, uh, light switch. I mean, you gotta be able to turn the lights on, right? I don't think the fish would be good at all. Nice painting, paw print, pendulum clock. Yo, pour in that milk. Oh yeah, we need a scary, I think I own a scary painting. <laughs> it's very Japanese for sure. Anything else on the wall that you guys think would be good? Oh, I said I liked the um, ventilation fan. Uh, what did I like? Wall clock. I like this wooden plank sign too. Why can't I have that? Because is that a crafted item? I like that a lot. I think I can find a spot for it on the wall. I don't know what it says in Japanese, but I think it looks pretty awesome. And then I liked the, um, it was like a hanging scroll. Yeah, I did. I, ha I think I have one. I think I have a hanging scroll. Let me take a look. Because I used to have one with my face on it. <laughs> Yo, okay, so these are the four new things. All right, send in the black TV. Oh, thank you so much, Romy. That was great. We were able to mitigate uh, what happened earlier. So that was awesome. Thank you. All right, so here we go. This one's going to be on the wall. On the wall. What do I have? Uh, here we go. Mm, a breaker. Don't need a breaker. 
I got Mona Lisa's for days. I do have the graceful painting, whoa. And I do have the hanging scroll, give me that, yoink. And I do have this, yes! Imperial decorative shells, nice. See, I'm telling you, I've got a lot of good taste here. Hanging scroll, I got a lot of good taste. What is a wooden plank sign? Oh, that was that thing. Should I do a light switch? Uh, sure. Like obligatory, obligatory light switch? Yeah, sure. Anything else? I mean, I, I don't have the air conditioner though. Scary painting. Whoa. I could put the scary painting. Whoa. Yeah, you know what? I think I think we should put some scary paintings on the walls somewhere. I don't know where though. <laughs> all right, all right. Here we go. Uh, let's do whatever's in my inventory and let's kind of see where we're gonna put them. Okay, so light switch. I think I have a spot for it. I think I'll just generically slap the light switch. Like as soon as you walk into a room, I think your light switches are like right here. Makes sense. And it's right at like eye level, a little under eye level. Yeah, sure, whatever, it, it's fine. All right, what else we got? We have a scary painting, imperial decorative shells and a hanging scroll. Well, I mean, you have to put this somewhere. It only makes sense. And I don't have a custom design spot for this either. So I honestly don't think I'm gonna put this anywhere. <laughs> as much as I love it with my life, <laughs> as much as it completes me, I don't think I'm gonna put it anywhere. It looks cool. Let me put it over here, hide it behind here, and you gotta, you have to, you have to be in the know to know where it is. So it's kind of like a hidden, a little Easter egg right there, hidden behind there. <laughs> Here's Imperial Decorative Shelves. This thing looks great right here. Oh my gosh, I could not find a better spot for it than right here. Dunzo, look at beautiful, beautiful. All right, what else? We have this, the scary painting. Um, let's put that right over here. Okay, so we kind of have one thing on every wall. I think it's good. All right, how about my hanging? Yeah, yeah, that's good. It's, it's perfect. Because now it just looks like something kind of like hidden back there. If you're curious about it, you would kind of pan the camera and go, Oh, you can see him. That's him. <laughs> yes. Oh, I love this. I love this. Adding a little bit of character, a little bit of ad lib makes it very fun. All right, let's take a look. Some of you guys sent some stuff. So this is good. It was really good. All right. All right. Here we go from Catwoman. Thank you. I tried to visit you earlier. That didn't work. Imperial black shelves. Ooh, that's okay. We'll have another set. And this is a pendulum clock. Ooh, where are we? Where would we put this? Hmm. And a new light switch. Oh, okay, okay. And this is a. Uh, if you want the plain coffee cup. What? Oh, hold on. Let's see. You can cut. Uh, you can customize the magazine to have one of the cats on it. I wish I could. I don't have the cat. Um, pictures anymore. I only have a picture of Gizmo. Like all of my things are done. All of my custom design slots are absolutely done. Like these are set. Like these are the paths. I have mine. We got Gizmo. We got these two 3D chests. I put the transparent one over here. I mean, I can gain what 13 additional ones if I just bite the bullet and just get rid of these yellow paths and then just do all gray paths. I can gain that many, but I would honestly have to have a need for 13 different QR codes or patterns before I pull that trigger. Not just one. So do I have a need for 13 of them? No, I don't think so. Not yet. Not yet. So that's kind of where we're at and, and why I don't add any more patterns because I'm full. And yes, I love the face of mine. It's, it's just so iconic. Okay, anyway. Oh yeah, a corner plant. Thanks for reminding me. I, I may have one. Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> Fan palm. I got, t ooh, Monstera. Yeah, let's go. Monstera. I could do this. 
Monstera! Yeah! Oh, whoa, whoa, hey, 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 hey. There we go. That's a little better. <laughs> nice. Okay, so then we got some other things in our pocket. Monstera. Ooh, here we go. No, we do not remove the bike path ones. Come on, man. Pay attention. The bike paths are very imperative, regardless of how the actual bike looks like on the pattern. <laughs> Alright, here we go. We have two competing coffee cups. Which one will win? Ooh. Ooh, I don't know. We'll have to take a zoom in, and we'll take a vote. <laughs> I don't know, man. All right, we got some other things. All right, oh, the LCD TV, is it in black? It is in black. All right, deal. The silver one goes away, the black one gets replaced. There we go. Little details. Imperial decorative shelves I already have, so we can um, do that. Pendulum clock. Pendulum with a J, pendulum. Right, no one pronounces it pendulum. Apparently it's pendulum. Pendulum, 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 pendulum. Pendulum. Looking good. Looking very good. I'll incorporate the pendulum with a J. All right, next is the light switch. All right, let's see what this light switch looks like versus my other one. Okay, same one. That's fine. No worries. Uh, and then the AC, air conditioner, Animal Crossing, Imperial decorative shelves, we have that. It's cool. And then I think once we get the AC, we're done. Wee. All right. Looking good. Looking good. Pendulum baby. All right. We're in this together. All right. Lan. Air. <sighs> Breathe in the air. Breathe it in. Sorry about the silver TV. Hey, no worries. No need to be apologetic at all. You're spending your hard-earned bells on these random items that you're sending to me. This is great. It's so great to have friends like all of you. Thanks so much. A present. I think we're good. Air conditioner. Oh, and the wooden plank sign. Hey, I forgot about that thing. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. I forgot about the wooden plank sign. I think our, our walls are getting a little much. They're getting a little big right now with the stuff. Although I could put the wooden plank sign here. Sure. Yeah, why the heck not? There's my hidden little face right here. Yeah, that that that's good. And then we have the uh, the the AC air conditioner. Oh <laughs> yeah, right there, dude. And it makes the it blows the wind on the tree here to give the the give the give the tree a little bit of life. That's really cool, dude. I think we did it like to a T. I think we did it. And look, the monstera is becoming a monster by moving like that. <sighs> Scary, right? I think we did it, guys. I think this looks amazing. What do you think? Very homey. Yeah, rated out of 10. Oh, we we're gonna vote on these cups. What is this, like a spilled cup? What the heck is this? Oh, oh, it's like a, like a little um, fleur de lis, like a little fancy print cup. Oh, I think it looks good. Um, we'll do the white cup. I think the white cup's better. Yoink. Hey man, got here, love the organization of the house, it's amazing. I had a friend of mine uh, think that men didn't play Animal Crossing. Oh man, what kind of friend is that? I'm glad I could prove her wrong now. Amazing job. Oh, will you tell her to come become a subscriber on my channel, all right, Sunshine? You got it? Good. What kind of friend is that? Boys and men don't play Animal Crossing? Yo, real men play Animal Crossing, how about that one? You tell that to your friend. No, I'm kidding. All right, this looks good. I think we're done. I think we're done. We can start looking at the next areas and uh start looking that way very very soon i think we could do the bathroom but i gotta leave in like about 20 minutes or so so we're gonna keep this as like a little bit of a shorty live stream no four hour trust me as much as i'd love to all right so this was my old like my old room and look my golden stag is over here so let's see what's up 
I got a lot of wall-mounted TVs, so I'm good on that front. I bought a lot of these crazy-looking things. So let's see. Got it. Look at all these TVs. Why so many TVs? You don't have this many TVs in your real house? Come on. <laughs> all right, here we go. This is gonna be the bathroom, okay? And I'll give you guys a little bit of context for what the bathroom is supposed to look like. But uh, I think that we did an amazing job, like truly an amazing job on this. All right, so here we go, the bathroom. Whoa, what in the actual, it's very, very tiny. So this bathroom, we may have to ad lib it, but there is a small, like a foot mat. Yeah, I don't know, man. Those aren't like, what are those, like poopy steps or whatever. Um, what are those things called, like squatty potty? <laughs> uh, anyway, so you can see over here that there's a couple things in here. There's a toilet paper dispenser. There's a toilet, obviously. It looks like a little bit of a peach flooring. I have no idea. But I think I might combine. Or we can, hold on, or we can do this, or we can make it this one, which is like everything. Okay, how about that? How about we ad lib it? So instead of the uh, the bathroom being the toilet section, uh, you've got your hand washing section right over here where you can wash your hands, and then you have your actual bathing section. How about instead of having them all segmented, maybe we can use panels, like simple panels? to kind of divide them. I don't know, just an idea, just an idea. There's a lot of things that we may need to go shopping for on this one. So uh, let's let's look at how Animal Crossing dissects this. I think it's, it's oh, I think it's a very, very small side room and I don't think that it'll translate as well. I don't think it'll translate as well. Uh, let me get rid of my shopping list and just kind of look. Right? Let's, let's, let's just play. I don't think so. It's not huge. So, I mean, even if I did have a toilet. Uh, wallpaper. Like, let's just pretend. Like, I gotta get out of outer space really quick. Um, <laughs> I gotta get out of outer space really quick. Okay, so what the? Alright, here we go. So, we're gonna do this. And we're gonna do this. Of course, it's not berry chocolates flooring, but I gotta. Outer space has gotta go. Goodbye. See ya. See ya. And coffee cup, see ya. And branches, goodbye. And I see you, orange. I see you, stray orange. Alright, so I do like the subway tile. This subway tile is actually a tile we should be using. Just gonna throw it out there. Alright, so other than that, let me see what we have here in my inventory. As far as toilets go, I think I have a toilet, let's see, time, type, alphabetical. Ocarina, Q-R-S-T-U-V-W-X-Y-Z, toilet, toilet. I don't think it's called the toilet, is it? Uh, where do my toilets go? Uh, didn't I have like an automatic toilet? <laughs> I don't know. You know, I think we just have to make a shopping list. So let's just make a shopping list. All right, here we go. We're going to make a shopping list. That seemed to have worked the best way last time. I don't know if we're going to go out and fulfill the shopping list on this episode because we're running low on time, but we can do our best. So shopping list for the bathroom. I'll show you guys really quick what this looks like again. And then you guys can um, see what's going on. Let me see this this okay so here we go uh we need some sort of vanity it appears we need a vanity where we can wash our hands and i think we have a vanity let's just start with that any suggestions if you guys want to throw out names of things that might look like it we'll try to find it uh where's the sink thing no wasn't there like a like a with, with a vessel bowl yeah, yeah, this thing. Ooh, bathroom sink. Yeah, 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 we're done. Dude, that's it. It's just called bathroom sink. 
Uh, bathroom sink. It comes in black, it comes in white, it comes in black, white, or brown. Uh, I think we're gonna go with white. I think we're fine with that. All right, deal. It's gonna be called bathroom sink, parentheses, white. So let's do it. And we got all this stuff. Thank you again. Uh, bathroom sink, parentheses, white. Done. Okay. So that's our first thing on our shopping list, according to the game. We can see that right over here, incorporated. Um, I don't know where we're gonna put it. Maybe up against the wall. I don't think we're gonna do a wall divider. Maybe we could. Like maybe if we have a fancy screen that can take like two spaces that makes it look like it's a separate room. I think that would be cool. I think we can get away with that. Because if you take a look at this, right? If you take a look at this, we could throw the toilet right here in the corner right? Toilet takes like two spots or maybe one and a half. I don't know. We can throw the sink over here. We can do some sort of divider. I guess it's easier if I do it this way, right? So toilet here, right? Toilet real estate space done toilet. Okay. And then we have the vanity right next to it, or maybe like right over here. Right. And then we do some sort of divider, maybe about this big. Um, wait a second. I'm sorry. Okay, if the room is entered from here. Okay, toilet here, sure. Vanity over here. Then we need maybe some sort of divider that goes from, I think here. Maybe one space over. Like I'm thinking right here, right? This is your divider. You can do some sort of divider this way. That fits that. And then you can see over here that we really only have four little baby squares. So that's a two by two, or that's a two by all the way across the top, the top there. So if we're looking at that, we need to somehow fit a tub over here. And I don't know if we can, we got to look at the bathtubs now. All right, let's look at toilets, right? Cause obviously we need toilet. So I'm going to go over here to toilet and you guys can see this really quick. Toilet. All right, all right, all right. I think it's gonna be regular toilet. Definitely not the squatty potty. That's a squat toilet. Didn't you guys call that the bidet? All right, anyway. Um, let's do this. Toilet, we're gonna add it to the list. Toilet, look how easy that is. I'm sure everyone and their moms has a toilet. In real life too. All right, so toilets, they're standing toilet. No, do you, does anyone own a standing toilet in their home? I don't know about that. Definitely not in the United States, at least. Um, let's look at, <laughs> let's look at our, uh, a bathtub, bath. Oh, dang, long tub. Oh, dang, it's one, two. Yeah, it's a, it's a one by two. This might work, a long bathtub. Ooh, nice little colors, white marble. Oh, look at that. Oh, dang, blue <gasps> with the subway tile. Hold on, let's look at the game. What color is the bathtub? I don't know, but what is that green thing right there? Hey, is that a bidet? What is that? Hold on, give me this thing. I don't want to hold it, but... What is that? Is... Can you guys tell me what that... It's not a receptacle. What is that? And there's a shower head, too. What is that green looking thing on the ground that goes up just as high as the bathtub? I don't know. You know, I think I'm gonna go for the um, the blue, that's a stool for sitting on. I don't know, man. I think it might be a bidet. I don't know, you guys are gonna have to look into Japanese culture and what they put inside their bathrooms. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I, I couldn't tell you. Oh yeah, you can, I'm sorry, thank you. Thank you, uh, you can press L or R triggers, there we go. So now you can see this a little bit better. Yeah, you can rotate the camera. <laughs> I forgot you can do that in this game. So there, you can kind of see it. I don't know what the heck that is, to be honest. It, a stool, why would a stool not have legs? Right, some of you guys are saying that's a stool. Or maybe that's a closed lid toilet, but what's that black dot on it? No, I think that's, I think that's a toilet without a lid. No, why would there be a toilet in the bathroom? Or sorry, in the bath area, in the bathing area? 
I don't know, but I do need a corner shower caddy. Yeah, do you guys got some shower accessories for me? A training potty for kids? Uh, no, they don't have any other kids other than Nate. He's the only kid, and he's pretty potty trained. I don't know why they'd leave that there. It looks like a trash can. What is the black dot in there? Why is it a trash can with a black dot in the middle? It looks like a drain. I don't know. Who's from Japan? They can tell me. Yeah, Yazzie has it right there. It's pretty some I'm pretty sure it's something we don't have in the United States. Yeah, they have a separate area for the toilet, so I don't think it's anything for a toilet, right? Like, it doesn't make sense. There's a separate area for the toilet, so why would they have another one over here? That doesn't make any sense. Um, I don't know. So something in a, sh in a Japanese shower room that is next to a bath. Anyway, I digress. Let's, uh, let's continue our shopping list here. So I like this a lot. The subway tile looks really good. So, yeah, I think I could do the one by... One by two, I think we can get away with it. Because if it's a one by two, it's just gonna look like this, right? And it's gonna be in that corner. Exactly like the game, like vertical like that. And then whatever we figure out is this little green thing. Maybe it's in the game. So maybe we'll put it over here into this thing. Um, we got the shower caddy that can be like right over here. I don't know if there's another, there's like another shower thing right over here on this side on the wall. And then there is like some sort of like mirror. Is there a wall mounted mirror? I think. Maybe some like towel holders. I'm pretty sure we have a towel rack. All right, well, let's look. Here we go. All right, back to work, back to work. Okay, so toilet for sure. We need towel rack. We need um, shower on the wall. We need a tub we need a, a mirror wall um what else some sort of caddy okay so these are the things that i'm like thinking and i don't know if they exist in the animal crossing world so that's kind of where we're at right now all right so let's look one thing at a time i do like this long bathtub it's from nook's cranny it's a two by one light blue so i'm gonna call that it's gonna be called a long bathtub where you can, or bath rub. Um, you can do that. This one's going to be light blue. Long bathtub, light blue, cool. So tub is done. Any other suggestions for these question mark things? Hmm, bathroom towel rack. All right, let's see, bath, oh, look at this thing. Yeah, 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 bathroom towel rack. This is fine. The uh, silver one is perfect. It was exactly on there. Okay, bathroom towel rack, done. Um, I don't need any of the other things for bath. Let's look at shower. There we go, shower set, you're right. Silver shower set, that's perfect. Bathroom towel rack. Oh, what color did I default that to? Silver. Okay, yeah, I did say silver in that. Okay, perfect. Uh, next. That's a shower on the wall. Uh, do we have like a little caddy? I'm definitely not gonna do a shower booth. No, no, that's too much. Yeah, definitely not. This is, it's too weird. It's cubicle. Like, no. Um... There's no wall-mounted mirror, huh? An air diffuser? Can you slap that on the wall? Cosmos shower? That's weird. No, thank you. Um, what else? Transparent custom design as a canvas? And use it as a wall mirror? That's, like, way beyond me. What? <laughs> um, let's see, let's see. There's no caddy, huh? Wall mounted. Wall mounted furniture for a bathroom. I'm just gonna, anything else. 
I don't think I'm gonna slap a bidet in there. I don't think that makes sense. Anything else for a bathroom? I like these. These are cute for a bathroom, but I don't know if they're appropriate. Oh, we could do mom's tissues, but how would we do that? Hmm. Where would we put mom's tissues? An iron wall rack. Uh, that's interesting to think about. And you can't put floor lights. <laughs> you can't put floor lights on the wall. So we need some like other lighting too. Like if it's a bathroom, you need some other lighting, don't you? What else can we put on the wall? Definitely not a radiator. Here's a shower set we've already seen. Oh, plunger set. Yes, Justine. Yes, plunger set would make sense because it is going to be a bathroom. So let's see. I don't... I guess I'm looking for wall-mounted stuff. Let's go plunger set. It's a good idea. Uh... Uh, furniture. Plunger. Look. What is it called? Oh, hang a bathrobe on the wall. <gasps> yes. Too many ideas. Too many ideas right now. Toilet cleaning set. Monotone. I'll take it. It is a bathroom and you have to clean it. But make sure you clean your toilet cleaning set once in a while. Gets a little... Nasty. Toilet cleaning set! Monotone. Alright, that looks good. Is there a toilet paper holder? Uh, are you guys just talking about stuff? Or are you just... <laughs> Holder. Uh, I don't think there is, exists an item called a toilet paper holder. I like the robe idea. I really like... I'm really hot on the robe idea. You can do like a his and hers kind of a deal. You can do like a, a pink one. You can do a pink and a blue one. Oh man, let's go. Yes, yes. Bathrobe, a pink and a blue one. Done, baby. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I like that idea a lot. I like it, I like it. Let's go bathrobe. Welcome, uh, you keys. You kids? Hi, welcome. Great to have you. You came at just the right time. We're talking about blue and pink bathrobes. It could be for the parents, right? For Nate's dad. Oh, bathrobe, parentheses, bathrobe? Yeah, sure, that makes sense. You don't have the, the bathrobe variety of bathrobe? Oh, okay, okay, I'm the only one that thinks about that? Got it. <sighs> do I have the towel rack? I do have the towel rack listed over here. Don't I? Yeah, I have a bathroom towel rack, silver. Slippers! You could do slippers on the wall too? Okay, okay. Do we have bath slippers? Nooking slippers. Oh, paw slippers. Rest restroom slippers? What? What does it say on here? Does that say mom? What the actual? Does that say wow or mom? <laughs> What the heck? It says WC? What does WC mean? I mean, I'll take them, whatever. Light blue, restroom, and pink slippers. Let's go. I'll, I'll take them. I'll take them. And I think I can put them on the wall. Those are gonna be really hard to find. Who actually shops at Kicks though? And what are the odds of him actually having those? Perfect. 
Japan Home. Have a small chair to sit on when they shower before going into a tub to relax. That's the green chair you see seeing in the game. Hey, thank you. There we go. Beautiful. It's a small chair. I see. That's the that's the confirmation that I needed. Thank you. And if it comes from a super chat, it has to be true. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, uh, you kids. Uh, what else are we missing here? Uh, put them on the floor under the robes. Yes, yes. What else? What else? What is a water closet? Excuse me. What is a water closet? Uh, yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Hmm. Oh, WC is for water closet, and a water closet is the name of a t uh, of the room where you have either a bathroom or something like that. Ah, I see. That's why it calls WC. I don't know about that. This is a Japanese game. Why in the world would they put WC? Do the Japanese people also call it a water closet in English? I don't know, man. All right. I mean that's a that's a theory. It kind of fits, or maybe it's someone's initials that works on the uh, works on the team. All right, um, an incense burner. I like the concept, but I don't know the execution. Right? Let like let's look at this really quick. Where? Oh well, I mean we can take a look. I need that little stool though. But why is there a hole in the stool? Like I don't understand that. It looks like there's a little hole there. It looks like a little baby toilet, but it, it doesn't make sense. All right, anyway. So, I don't know, is there a little green rug with footprints on it somewhere? Like, that I can put over there? Like, I like the incense burner, but I don't know where to put it. I like the mirror concept. That's for your finger to lift up the stool? What? Who has a... Okay, I have no idea. You're gonna have to send me a picture of this item. Whatever this green thing is, send me a real life picture. Tweet it at me, at Abdallah Nation, and we'll, um, we'll take a look at it. Because like right now, that's just, uh, that's a little, a little, a little too different, let's just say. All right, so we got about 15 minutes left of the live stream. Let's see what we can do. About 15 minutes. A uh, green bath mat, rattan stool with white and green. I'll take a look. Let's take a look at it. Rattan stool with white and green. This. Huh. Okay. I'm all right with it. I'm, I'm honestly all right with it. Or do we do a wooden... No, wood in the bathroom? Absolutely not. Rebecca, hey. Wooden stool, and it can be made to be blue. Yeah, I see that now, thank you. A blue, you know, I think the rattan, I think the rattan might do it. I think that's really nice. The wooden stool also is a close second, for sure. All right, let's see. It's gonna be called the rattan stool in white. And we're gonna put that right next to the tub. Mirror on the wall, caddy, I don't know if we have those items. But some of you guys were talking about an idea of using a transparent print with some item. So if you could elaborate on that with more than just two words, that'd be great. But as of right now, I don't think um, I don't think we need anything else. We may need some pretty cool, like I don't know, wall stuff. I don't know, man. Uh, furniture, wall mounted. Abalone. The heck is abalone? You can put it on the wall? No way. <laughs> you can put an abalone on the wall? Dang, that's some abalagna. All right, what else? Air conditioner? No. Like, I'm just looking at all these things. Ooh, what is this? Coconut wall planter? Oh, that's a little decorative. I've never seen that before. Give me that in my life right now. 
mirror on the wall, and then I'm just gonna do like a, a little separate area for like decorations. A coconut wall planter? I never heard of it. I don't think I've seen this in anyone's house. It looks cute, like you can decorate a bathroom with it. You could also decorate the fish stuff. I don't know, it's kind of formal paper. There's no toilet paper holder. I also like the hanging scroll. I'm a big fan of the hanging scroll, you guys know that already. Uh, what else, what else? Intercom monitor? I've fallen and I can't get up, help! <laughs> Life alert. I think we're good, guys. I, I don't think that there's anything else. Wreaths? No, they don't have a place in the bathroom. Ta uh, tapestry? Tapestries? I mean, no. I like the idea of the, the scent infusing things, so maybe like a table? Alright, alright, there's already too many things on our list. Let's see what we can get um, in our 15 minutes left. And then call it a day. So let me get this uh, shelf going over here. So this is kind of what I'm thinking for the area. Oh, and the floor. I didn't even look at the flooring. Hold on, hold on. What's the flooring even look like? I mean, if we get like some sort of bathtub flooring, I think that would be pretty good. So um, I'll show you what that looks like. This is what it looks like. It's like some sort of tile, like straight square tile flooring. Maybe something like that exists in Animal Crossing. So let's double check it. So, we're gonna look at, uh, flooring, floors, mm-hmm, 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 blue desert tile, nope, berry chocolates, nope, any suggestions? That's the hole to pick it up, Priscilla, is that right? So there is a hole to pick up a stool, interesting, thank you for taking the extra time out of your day to research that. I might invest in one. Cute white tile flooring looks kind of cool. Cute blue tile flooring looks a little clashy. It's very, it's very dark. And I don't think that it's gonna go well with this. I really like that wallpaper though, so I don't, I don't think I'm gonna use this blue tile flooring. I think that this cute white might work. Green vinyl, uh, there's so many. I don't know, what do you think? Yeah, I, I might do this. Cute white tile, let's, let's just try it. Let's try it for now, cute white tile. All right, cute white tile flooring. I think that's our shopping list. And then now it's just a matter of um, just making sure that we um, can have some of it. All right. So what do you think? I might have something. Rebecca, aqua tile flooring. Ooh, that's an idea. Aqua tile flooring. Let me see what I got. Let me see what I got. Do I not have aqua tile sort by name? Do I not have aqua tile? I don't. Cherry blossom flooring. Uh, what looks good? Ooh, honeycomb. Honeycomb might work. Hold on. Cute white tile has hearts in it. Oh, I didn't realize that. Then that's not gonna work. I don't. Like, I don't want something cute. This is a little much. That's a little too clashy. I don't think so. No, that's a little much. What is this? White wedding flooring. Dun, 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 dun. <gasps> oh, that actually looks good. If I just rotate it the other way, where is it? Yo, natural divisions out here? There's more. Oh my gosh. This. Oh man, yes. Yo, the wedding flooring looks so good. I mean, the lines are a little off, but, but this is exactly where a natural divide is going to be. <gasps> Ooh. 
looks good. That looks really good. Like, I'm not even gonna adventure. It, like, matches. It so matches. But then I need some dividers, too. Some partitions. Ooh, we need some partitions. All right, you know what? Wait, I need a partition. Because we said we were going to divide the place, right? So let's partition it up. All right, here we go. What kind of partitions, guys? Talk to me about partitions. All right, ready? Oh, yeah? Give me some good, ooh, black partition. But you can kind of see through it. Bamboo partition? Like, what are we gonna put for walls? Simple panels? Simple panel takes half a space. Ooh, simple panels, simple panel. Oh, dang, with this window design. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm falling in love with this bathroom. Whoa, with the light brown planks? Hold on. Yo, hold on, or this. With the black, no, we go white, no, gray, white, gray, beige, gray, brown, gray, yellow, gray. Oh my gosh, there's a million different colors. Bodies get bodied. I don't know, man. I like this. Light gray and lattice. Ooh, or glass panel? What is glass panel? This is glass panel? I think, I think either the brown or this, but I think simple panels could work. I think so. Give me about, I got like five minutes and I gotta run. Give me about a couple minutes to see what we got inside of our mailbox and then we're out of here. We are out of here. Berry chocolates, get out of here, man. Yo, we did really good today. In the time that we had, in about two hours, I think we did amazing. Light brown with the lattice. Oh, you guys like, dude, like three people back to back to back said that. All right, let's see what you guys sent in the mail. Oh man, all right, let's see, let's see. Wow, okay, okay. You guys are spoiling me. I hope you like your shiny new toilet and a shiny new bathroom sink. Well, it better not be a used toilet. That's for sure. Ugh. Get a new wax ring. Ugh. You guys ever have to uh, deal with a, uh, a wax ring on a toilet before and toilet installation? Ugh. Nice, nice. Dang, look at this. Bathroom towel rack. Ooh. Yo, we got some stuff. Whoa, way more stuff. Dang, to be continued bathroom time. Toilet cleaning set, awesome, thank you. Oh, there we go. I hope you guys don't mind that you guys are sending doubles. So don't worry about that. I think you're good. The rattan stool. Aqua tile, oh, okay. Aqua tile flooring, we'll take a look. We got a little bit of time. These flowers are really slowing me down here. These flowers though, Ugh. These are the hybrids that I had to dig out. We're over you. Yeah, 987 toilets, but you gotta craft them all. Okay, so we got some slippers, which is cool. Uh, we got a lot of things right now. So let me just, all right, you know what, here. Okay, get ready. Look at this beautiful room. Oh, it looks so good. And then remember, we're gonna have to transpose all of this to the actual new house. So I'm gonna have to take pictures <laughs> of like all the things so I don't mess it up. Okay, here we go. This is going to be a toilet. Uh-huh, that's not what I remember a toilet looked like, but sure. There's your toilet, cool. This was the little bath mat, Hey. okay. Yes, sure, whatever, here you go, done. All right, what else, what else you got? A toilet, all right, cool, cool, just in case, you know, his and hers, no, I'm just kidding, thank you. Uh, we got a bathroom sink, all right, bathroom sink. We're just gonna put it right next to it for now. The window is really bad. That's throwing a wrench in my plans, that window, because one does not simply do this, right? That's really stupid. <laughs> like, there are designing rules. And the fact that there's a window in this wallpaper stinks. So now that's a wrench in my plans. 
Ugh. All right, Rattan Stool. This little guy, ooh, beautiful, beautiful. We needed him right here. We got that tub toilet cleaning set. Oh, where am I gonna put that? Mm, it's gotta be within like a stone throws distance. Maybe over here. I don't know, for now, it's a temporary spot. All right, here we go. Lounge bathtub. Whoa, that thing's way too long. It's fine. It's longer than I expected. Where are these simple panels gonna go, though? Ugh. Okay, 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 here we go. This is the shower set. Okay, that's kind of what we wanted. Were there two shower sets? There were. I don't know if I have a use for two shower sets, but... I mean, the more jets, the merrier. Am I right? You don't have two shower sets in your uh, in your master bathroom. Oh, bathroom towel rack. Yeah, I will put that here. You don't want to get that dirty. Another bathroom towel rack. Okay, so we got two of those. That's fine. What's this? Uh, toilet cleaning set. We already have. Um, this is the restroom slippers. Uh, let me look at the game really quick while I'm putting this out here. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. All right. I, I kind of see this now. So it's not two showers, but it's something else. I'll show you really quick. It's the, uh, you go into the area and directly in front of you is the shower. Then there's the mirror, then a window. Um, and then on this wall is your little bath, um, your bath towel set. There's no caddy for shampoo or anything like that, which is interesting. So anyway, let's take a look. Okay. So I don't need two, but uh, I could do this and then I could take this and bring it over here. And we can call um, a little bit closer. Yeah, because it has to be in the bathroom, like right here, but not too close that it's going to get sprayed on, right? You don't want it to get sprayed on. All right, so it looks good so far. Uh, the restroom slippers, let's take a look. Ah, the restroom slippers, the restroom slippers, where do those go? You know, I can do this. One. Two. And they are gonna get a little wet. I think that should be a fine. Or maybe I'll move the restroom slippers outside of the actual area. Maybe like over here. Once we get the partition. Ah, uh, that's probably what I'll do. Yeah, it doesn't make sense for them to be right there. I could put them, um, if the partition's gonna be a half, then I can do this. But I can't hang anything on the partition either. Ugh. Mmm, okay, let's see what else we have. It's a little rough. The bamboo partition is also an idea. Like, I was toying around with that idea. We'll see. But I do like, I honestly do like that. Cause like when you're out here like taking a bath, like you do want some privacy. I've seen um, I've seen hotel rooms across the uh, the United States where they've had that little aesthetic where it's like the bathroom is like completely open to the main room, like you just see everything. All right, cool. <laughs> a nice solo bathroom, sure. But if you got company over and you're like, yeah, I'm gonna take a shower. I need you to like go to get out of the room really quick. <laughs> like, uh, okay. All right, here we go. Here we go, aqua tile flooring. Oh, interesting, interesting. I'll try it out, see if it looks good. Better than the wedding flooring, for sure. Okay, simple panel, simple panel. <laughs> Retains the coconut wall. Oh, coconut wall planter. Yeah, we were thinking about those. All right, let's go. Ba -da -doo, da -da -doo. Ba -da -doo 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 -doo. Aqua tile flooring, place on the floor. Ooh, mm, I like it. I just think it's, I think it's a little much. Like it's a little too much pattern. Whereas this one, I think it's not. Yeah, I like, it. I like the idea. I just, I don't think it's gonna fit right now. If I didn't stumble across the wedding and fall in love with it right off the bat with a marble tile and the color that matches perfectly with the subway tile, I probably would have um, would have liked it. So I think the wedding just looks so good. All right, anyway. 
Okay, so let's see. Stuff in my pockets is a rattan stool. We have one. Thank you for sending it. No worries. A simple panel. Ooh, I, ooh, brown, huh? You went with brown. Interesting. Two brown. Okay. I would need one... One... Two? I think I would need two or three more of that coloration. I don't know. I think brown clashes, to be honest. Because everything else is white. So I might as well... I might just, like order my own simple panels for that and then go customize them. Um, I just think the brown, it just stands out in a non, in like a clashy way. If it was white, it would match the, the trim on the window. It would match the bathtub. It would match a whole bunch of other things. So uh, yeah, I don't know about that. But we'll, we'll put those there for placeholders for now. This is the coconut wall planter that I was a little uh, obsessed with for a second there. It looks cool, right? Like you could, you could slap that right over here. This, I think we're gonna put some, like, some artwork. Maybe those little fishing signs or something. Something needs to go there. Over here, maybe a clock or something, I don't know. Um, but yeah, things, things are looking pretty okay. All right, what was this? This one was a toilet cleaning set, which I already have, but I'll put it in my storage. And I think we're good. Okay. So in review, what do we have? Like this is, it's still a work in progress. We'll finish it tomorrow for sure. Um, but take a look at it. Bathroom sink is done. Our toilet is done. Long bathtub light blue is done. We've got the towel rack done. Shower set done. Cleaning set done. We got both the slippers done. We got the rattan stool. I found a better flooring. And then I really just, dude, we are actually done with this. All we need is the red and the blue bathrobes and finding us somewhere to put them. I don't know, man, where are we putting them? I mean, we could put the bathrobes over here, but if you're getting ready for the bath, you know, maybe that's what we do. I was honestly thinking like this, look, hear me out. This is what I was thinking for the bathroom. I was thinking of slapping the, uh, the men's here, right? The men's here, the women's here, it's a little too close. I might be able to scoot them over one, right? So if it's like here, this is gonna be one bathrobe. And then that means the other one is gonna be right here. And then I was gonna do the shoes like right on the floor, right in front. So this one's going to be in these squares. This one's going to be the, uh, the ladies. This one's gonna be the men's, but that's too much stuff in the bathroom over there, right? It's just too much happening. So I think we just utilize this. So since there's nothing really happening in between there, let's do this. I think if I center it right here and then I do on the wall, the bath things, and then I just do the, um, the simple panels here. And then I think the bathroom's done. Aside from possible other decorations, like maybe some paintings and whatnot, maybe some other uh, planters or whatever. All right, this looks good. Robes on both sides of the door? That also could be it. Yeah, I also like that idea. And then we can move this thing like like right over here. If I could slap the, the slippers over there, over there. We'll try it out. Once we get the robes, I think we'll just put them on the wall and it'll be a little bit easier to visualize versus just kind of like using this little cursor over here. But other than that, guys, I think we're pretty much done. We're done for the amount of time that I have. Thank you so much for watching. We are going to uh, see you guys tomorrow for some more Animal Crossing. Um, and then, like I said earlier this week, we've got some Super Mario 3D All-Stars that we're gonna be focusing on. So I love the fact that you guys hang out with me and we play Animal Crossing all the time. I really want you guys to come support my other series that I have on the channel as well. So make sure you guys do so. I think this looks great. We did this together, and thank you every single one of you guys that were ready with your Dodo codes, all of you guys that had your items and offered them in chat, and especially all the friends that are mutuals on board that were able to send these really cool items over to us. We did the entire front room, and it looks exactly like it does in the game, with a couple extra additions. So very, very happy with how this is working out. Um, yeah, and in the bathroom, it's literally going to take two or three things, and then we're going to be done with it. It's going to be spot on. So then tomorrow, what we can do is we can jump into the, we'll make a shopping list for the kitchen and then the master bedroom, which is going to be on the side over here. We're going to need like two big beds. 
um, because that's kind of how it is in this game. Um, so yeah, this one's gonna be the upstairs kitchen. I can already tell I'm gonna need like the diner serving counter. We're gonna need a fridge. We're gonna need some other cool stuff. But yeah, say goodbye to the Raymond photos, man. All right, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys had a great time today. Um, I know I did. It was. It's always really fun to just open up a building stream and then keep on going. So here's what I need to do now. Let's go over, I need a bed. I need a bed really quick. Let's go update my town so that you guys can uh, enjoy it really quick. Uh, bed. I don't know, what the heck, what is a bed called? Do I have, oh, it's called an ironwood bed, right? I think I have an ironwood bed. So if I just slap the bed somewhere. <laughs> ironwood bed. Is it not an ironwood bed? Oh my gosh, it's not an ironwood bed. What's the bed called? Don't you dare say bed. Bed? Your bed to me. Yo, what is it? Oh, is it called Luna's bed? It's called Ironwood. I, me I went past it. Okay, good. Ironwood. Oh, yeah. See, it doesn't look like an ironwood bed. <laughs> it looks like something else. All right, all right, all right. Funny jokes, people. You guys are funny. We're going to update our dream address, though, because uh, we made some extra additions to the town. Place it. Go to bed. And then we're going to update. Because some of you guys like visiting the town, right? So we might as well update every time we're doing this. I was hanging on to Science Island for a little too long. It's a true story. A little too long I was holding on to Science Island. But now, I think we're having a way better time than we ever would have in Science Island. All right, here we go. Visit my dream address. Send me some pictures. Send me some pictures. We got the brand new room. It looks good. Close my eyes. Picture what you love most about Abdala Nation. And then we connect to the internet. Okay, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you guys tomorrow for even more builds. And then um, I think on Wednesday, we're going to like slow down a little bit on Animal Crossing because we got to pump out a whole bunch of Mario stuff. But if you guys like these little bite-sized, maybe one and a half to two hour streams where we just build one little section and then move on with it, I'm down for that. I don't really have the commitment for like four hours anymore, but like, yeah, I'm down. If that's what you guys like, give me a thumbs up in the comments. Anyway, make sure you guys are all subscribed, turn on notifications and join the Discord if you guys wanna trade some Animal Crossing furniture or whatever, feel free to do that. I'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching. Welcome all of our members that came on board and thank you guys for all your super chats. You guys are great. All right, visit my town. I'll see you later.